the creation of a 21st century learning tool was quite a challenge. It was fun to use Google Sites and be able to work with that and use the Google Forms. The Google Forms have a variety of different ways that they can be used. BlendSpace is an amazing tool that is um, a site where everything can come together and be pulled together so that teachers can hold everything at one spot instead of trying to dig and find the resources when they're ready for them. This is a great tool to use in class where you can choose a topic and address that blend space toward that. There are a lot of videos and documents out there and available to be able to pull lessons together without doing a lot of extra work. Google Forms are an amazing, <laughs> for me, new invention. I never really used them before. I've received them and had to fill them out. But now adding them to entrance tickets, sign up forms, the idea of to my homework for tonight, the students had to read for 30 minutes and then tell me where they were at in the book. And so instead of just having them fill in a paper, they logged on to our Google site and then we'll click on the Google form and fill it out with the title of their book, how many minutes they read, how many pages they read, and a little summary. And it's quick and easy to submit and I'll be able to use that. I think this would really help if a lot of teachers would use this because it will cut down on paper as well as give them the chance of gathering data in an easy way. With this 21st century uh, web page that we created, I included Expeditions, the Google Expeditions app. Had I not done that, I probably wouldn't, uh, I would not have been able to realize how much fun learning could be about different topics. So the students worked on it today and I taped them. There were times where I was not able to video them, but the, hearing the sound of, oh, as soon as we went from the planet uh, Jupiter to Neptune, so they could see the different planets and the color blue and the gases that made it up. Um, what was fascinating about it was how easy it was to put the phone into the um, VR viewer. Some of the kids actually had viewers at home that they brought in as well as their own devices. And then we used those, we created the expedition. To guide the expedition was fabulous because it had the information right there and questions to um, guide them on. And so the students really enjoyed it and I really enjoyed it too. I'm gonna include a little bit of um, footage about that. Really small. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot of you can sit back down. Get a little. You're walking. Yeah, that's all you. 